What's up boys, Psycho Buckle here, bringing you another One Piece Treasure Cruise video. For this, we'll be going over Adventure Mode Cavendish, we'll do my showcase for him, as well as the Pentamaxi and everything going along with it. So, uh, without further ado, we're just going to go in right to it. Uh, while I'm doing this, go ahead and make sure you guys hit the like button down below, as well as the subscribe button down below, so we get lots of support in the channel and keep the channel growing. If you guys want to support the channel, we are over 3,100 subscribers, so guys, thank you so much for the support again, really do appreciate it. Um, if you guys want to make sure you get notifications on all the second Poker videos, make sure you guys hit the little bell notification down next to it so we can get uh, you get notifications every time I drop a video. Okay, so right right out the gate, we're going to start uh, getting this limit break on the Cavendish, and he takes 3 million XP to limit break. Got him max limit broken. We just finished getting all the crystals, which takes 975,000 adventure mode points. Uh, for the limit break, he is going to gain a buttload of stats, uh, 500 HP, 205 attack, uh, 80 recovery, five, four more sockets going up to five sockets, and he's going to lower his cooldown by 15. Also raising his captain ability, giving himself some sailor abilities, etc. So he's getting a lot of good stuff. It takes 637 of the, of the uh, limit break crystals, 561 mediums, and 101 large crystals to fully limit break him, which doesn't really matter. You don't need to know the numbers because all you need to know is you need to get to 975,000 adventure mode points. So here we go. Max limit break Cavendish. Bam! Feels good. Now, in scale up, I already maxed this dude out, so let's go ahead and get this guy all socketed out. And I will go ahead and speed up the video so you guys can see everything. Um, all done. So you can see his two limit break abilities are going to be pinch healing, uh, which maxes out um, at 40% uh, 40 threshold, and the damage reduction, which maxes it at 5%. So I'll go ahead and speed up this portion of the video so you guys can see me getting them all done with all my many, many copies of Cavendish um for them sockets and i also have in case i don't max them i have a couple um extra sockets here but here we go so cavendish is going to be a 2.5 times uh driven captain with two, healing two times recovery every single turn so uh you want are going to want to get attack and recovery candies on your cavendishes because it'll maximize your captain ability uh the way i actually went bind despair auto heals charge special and slot rate because i wanted to get uh more or matching orbs on characters for uh different teams and i figured damage reduction was not super useful um when I started using more and more teams with this, um, I didn't really feel like I needed damage reduction. I didn't feel like I was pining for it, so that's why the sock gets more slot rate. Um, also, the other thing with Cavendish is that if you, the way his captain ability works is that if you hit three uh, good greats or perfects um, with three characters of the same color on your team, the next three characters on your team are going to hit for a 3.75 multiplier. Putting Cavendish kind of like a 3.5 multiplier going to a 3.75 multiplier just to get your maximum boost for him. So definitely get attack and recovery on him as well for maximum Smart Cavendish. things today, man. Doing smart stuff. All right. So for 100%, you're going to go attack and recovery because his captain ability is... Uh, boost attack of driven characters and then recovers 1.5 times recovery in HP at the end of every turn. So yes, 100% a good idea to get recovery on this guy. Okay, there's attack and recovery. Bam! Cavendish is completed. Fully limit broken, fully maxed. He is now PENTAMAXED! 1796 attack. Nice, nice, nice. So now I have two, uh, I'm working on two Pentamax Cavendishes right now. Working on two. So that's pretty spot. That's pretty fire. It's pretty fire. All right. Okay, so we're going to we're gonna start this up with a, um, I want to run a Dofi Forest with, um, with a cabinet with a free Cavendish with max recovery. So we'll see how much the max healing is for this team. And I'm actually kind of curious what that is. So it's 1.5 times recovery for both, um, both characters. Yeah, 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 yeah. Be careful about that. Yeah, yeah I, will. I will. Well, I guess it, I won't need to be because, like, so Toad. So what I'll do is like, I'll use the left Zoro and the right Dofi to get full board matching with orb boost type boost, and then if I get badly matching, then I'll switch. I'll use Cavendish for orb manipulation and, and boost, and then another turn one badly matching and all that. But I can I can like change my rotation accordingly. I kind of have a bad typing for this, though, to be honest. All right, so the team heals for 2,000, and at the end of the turn, he heals for 3K. Okay, so you basically heal for 3K. So at max recovery, you're at 2,928. That's not bad. You know what I should have brought? I should have brought another blue unit. Maybe I should have brought the other Barto to do like a half quick, half heal. 
20 with a 23,000 HP team healing for almost 3k is pretty cool I'm kind of liking that all right all right so originally the translation said you have to attack with three of the same typing to get an increased attack boost and all right so we did about 200,000 there so now we're gonna attack with three side units and then go to a blue unit or I guess we'll go to another side unit or something we'll go to the blue unit oh wait I have to hit three goods and then I have to hit okay you have to hit goods you have to hit goods so let's do it right dude can I hit a good holy shit <laughs> can I hit a good that would be nice, right? If I could actually hit kids. Oh my god. Alright, are, are we at the real part of the force now? I'm definitely seeing a captain ability increase there. Because that did way more damage for those two units. Alright, so this is the HP cut. We get like a 70% HP cut. Oh, pinch healing triggers in there too. Oh, that's cool. So if you get low, you have pinch healing to save you too. That's really cool. All right, so there's the captain ability increase for damage, and then there's the, the last that did way more. Okay, that's cool. This is cool. This is really cool. All right, so now we have... Okay, here's the captain swap. I don't actually know what Zora's captain ability is. So, uh, but I don't think it's going to matter. It's pretty unlikely we're actually going to hit off. I could use Zoro here just to get, like, my the paralysis gone. <laughs> to be honest. But I don't really care that much. Maybe I'll hit a good. One of these days. I learned to hit goods, boys. I learned to hit a good. Was that 70,000? All right, so we got attack down. Okay, so let's go Psy, 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 quick, quick. Holy crap, that, that damage scaling. That went up really high really fast. It was just like nothing, and then all of a sudden it was just massive. You definitely feel the power. I'm feeling underpowered, of course, as a Delphi Forest. And we're getting, like, anti-damage here, but we'll see how hard he hits right here. Alright, so this is with 50% damage reduction. We're hitting over 300,000. That's not bad. Alright, so there's that bind that we know and love. I don't think... It, do I have anything that reduces bind? Do you, I don't think you do. No. He does cap damage, though, which is very helpful. No strength to make the double dex though if he really hard. Yeah. I'm definitely feeling like that's going to be really hard, Totsuki. I'm definitely feeling that's going to be really hard. But I do have damage cap, so that will make it a little bit better. And I can delay. Alright, so you just have to hit four perfects here, essentially. Fuck. <laughs> that was almost over very quickly. All right, so we're going to do delay type boost or boost and I guess I'll start with Psy huh that 
That was pretty decent. Two two point eight million with a one point five type boost and a two times orb boost. That was pretty decent, especially with no type advantage there. That, that's that's not bad at all. All right, so I guess we'll just chill out here for a couple turns here to get some cooldowns back up. Let me try to get this blue orb. No luck. Alright, so that if I can one-shot this Diamante, that would be fire. Because now we finally have type advantage, so we get to see what this guy can do, if I can hit perfects. Okay, that was cool. That was 1.3 million. <laughs> that was 1.3 million with no buffs. That was pretty cool. So I can already see this guy is going to be fun. <laughs> this is going to be a very fun unit. 100%. When you get that type advantage, holy crap. Alright, so we're healing for 3k a turn now. This is going to be interesting. Holy crap! That was way more than I anticipated. That was way more than anticipated. Alright, here we go. So I want to kill the bottom Dofi first, I think, right? I think I want to kill the bottom dopey first. The top one gives the buffs, but I'm okay with that. Here we go. Okay. Oh, the bottom one gives the buffs, not the top one. Oh, interesting. I got that wrong. All right, so now we get the damage cap up for two turns. So now we're going to do... I'm going to pop a Cavendish special, because I want to see it. Interesting. All right, so now... I'm going to pop the Zoro special for orbs. And we're going to try to kill this dude, I guess. Yeah, I don't think it matters, Toad. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, okay. So the Barto special we lost, though. We removed the Barto special. I didn't know that he removes debuffs, too. Oh, he, he doesn't remove positive buffs. Okay, okay. So now I know. Well, we have to heal, though. So it's fine. I should be okay. All right. So we're going to we're gonna have to stall on this dude a little bit. But it's okay. Interesting. All right, so I don't want to delay this turn. I want to delay next turn. I don't even have to delay that much too, which is crazy. Because all that pinch healing. Oh my gosh. So we're gonna we're gonna pinch heal now. Look at this pinch healing. Oh, pinch healing works off perfect, right? Oh, it only works on the Cavendishes. Oh, interesting. Okay, so Pinch Healing only works off the Cavendishes. I did not know. No idea. It does not work on every unit on the team. Now I know. All right, this is the one I can get below 20, I believe. We'll wait one more turn before we do anything, I guess. I 
I think I was supposed to stall on the bottom one, not the top one. Pinch healing, huh? <laughs> Look at that! That pinch healing is so useful. But oh my god, we got bad turns this run. All right, so let's go ahead and I oh mean, this this cooldown is like insanely fast. All right, so we're gonna do this, and then I'm gonna go ahead and pop this and this. And then we'll damage cap that. And then I think I'm gonna start up on Dellinger and then we'll try to kill Lauji in the back. Okay, we got Giola pretty low, but we didn't kill her. It just really stinks. Okay, so now we have to kill Sugar and the other one. Um, I don't have to kill Sugar this turn, but I, I can kill Mockies in like two turns, right? Or can I try to kill him this turn? Well, oh, I have to kill Sugar in like two turns. Yeah, yeah, so let's kill Sugar. Oh man, that damage reduction. That damage reduction is no joke. All right, so I'm gonna have to pop, uh, I'm gonna have to pop that special for sure. All right, so let's do this. Ugh. Ugh. All right, so I might die. I might die. Okay. So here comes Mach Beast. He's going to hit me for 902, and then... 17,000. Okay, that hurt. That hurt. But three turn we have three turns now. Oh, do we did I need Okay, so he, I have I can get pinch healing here though. Oh shit. Only only if I can, you know, hit perfect so it'll be okay. So, Mockfeast It's going to be kind of rough next turn. All right, so we'll have Zoro back up. If I can kill him this turn, we'll, I think we'll be okay. I don't know if I can though. Okay. Is it two turns of delay or only one turn of delay? Am I dead? Oh, it's two turns of damp delay. Oh wait, so. But I only have to take one hurt, one hit from Dofi. Oh, interesting. Wait, what? Oh, I'm dead. Then I thought it was. I thought this went away. I guess I was wrong. Okay. All right, and we're back, and we're trying a Fuji Judge team now to try and beat this with a Cavendish sub. So let's see how Cavendish works as a sub on a Fuji Judge team. Because so um, this is my my uh, the best team I could actually think of. Actually, this is a. It was really hard to actually find a team for Cavendish to run on where you get the maximum amount of damage, and Judge was actually a really great character 
to bring out a lot of Cavendish's potential. Um, you can see here I'm actually hitting like you can't like for the first couple turns you don't really see any big damage here. Um, but what I, I did see with the Cavendish and Judge Jimmy is that you get so many orbs. Literally, you have four out of seven year orbs matching for most of your team, and you have a psi orb increase, making it so that you have way higher chance of getting psi orbs. And anytime you get a tan or a meat orb, it's matching because of Fuji, plus um, their own matching orb. And uh, psi orbs are matching for uh, Cavendish and Judge, so most of your characters have four to seven, and the Cavendish and Judge have three to seven, but even increased um, psi orb. Get that extra little heal there, which is kind of cool. It's kind of cool to see that, that little pinch heal hit. I mean, it's not like super necessary, but it's kind of cool. All right, so this is awesome because now I have like a full board of orbs and I'm not even trying. Just this is pretty cool. <laughs> not gonna lie. And see how Cavendish is on a 14 to cooldown, which is really short. Uh, we can have him up a bunch of times. So, I mean, I could pop him right here. We just clear this room. He does heal for uh, 1224, which is you know Christmas, which is also fun. All right, so we're just gonna start this off. Bam, bam. Oh my gosh, the damage. Oh my gosh, damage. <laughs> oh my gosh, the damage. Oh my gosh, one special, boys. One special. Cavendish as a sub is pretty fire. I am not gonna lie. Cavendish as a sub is, is really cool. I'm digging this. This new Cavendish sub is, is awesome. All right, so remember last time we had the major type advantage? <laughs> and with like full orbs and type advantage, we did 1.3 million. Um, so I'm definitely seeing that there is a damage difference between the two. You can scale really, really high with the Cavendish versus the Judge Fuji team. And I think you get about the same amount of damage between both teams. But Judge Fuji obviously has a lot more HP, so it can be a little bit safer. It's just, you know, you never know. Okay, I got him. <laughs> I got him like 30, so he'll just heal up real quick. And now I can chill out for one more turn and it's nice because i'm getting the damage reduction from judge but i can also trigger the pinch healing here if i'm below 40 percent which is really cool too I'm not, there's lots of little tricks here i'm liking that all right so here we go here's the orbs five out of seven orbs this team is so bonkers with orbs man it's so bonkers oh my gosh you get so many matching orbs this is like the new Cerebral, man. Holy crap. Alright, there's that 50% HP cut. All right, so I'm going to want to kill the top one this time. I learned that from last time. Um... Oh, dude, I, I totally want 6 plus Fuji now. Now that now this cap doesn't exist, I totally want 6 plus Fuji. 100%. Ooh. I'm just not realizing that would be a really good idea. But I can't do it right now because I need to save it. I'm going to need to save a few of these. So we're going to we're gonna see how damage damage we do without specials here. All right, that's pretty good, that's pretty good. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead, oh my God, five matching orbs again, dude, what the heck? That's insane. So we're gonna head and, I'm gonna pop a Caesar special here. Cause I'm gonna need a little more damage here. And then we'll pop Fuji, I'll pop the Judge next turn, if we really need it. Alright, so we do a little damage here. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, so now from what I remember, I don't want to pop too much damage too early here. And I can actually trigger an extra turn here. Alright, so now he's going to it can increase his attack. And then we're gonna go ahead and go in. Okay. So I got kind of crappy turns again. It is what it is. Uh, my orbs are good, which is which is nice. Um, 
I'm gonna want to kill Dellinger and, and Giola in this first turn. And if I can, try to kill Mockbeast as well. That would be really good. So let's go ahead and do a Judge Shuffle. Oh, didn't get the matching orb of the Judge. I don't know about this. I don't know about this plan. But we're gonna, we have increased Psy orb matching, so we have a good chance of getting a Judge orb next turn. So I guess what I can do is just start it up and hope for the best. And uh, yeah, here we go. <gasps> Fuck, I, I lose, dude. I lose. I lose so bad. I lose so bad. I can't believe I missed. That was just me messing up. That was. There's nothing else. Just me messing up. I think I'm 99% sure we lose now. Unless we can be a young god here and just clear all of them. I'm pretty sure we lose though. <gasps> what? Oh my god! Look how close that is! That was so close! <laughs> I want to try that again. I want to try that again. Round two. I'm gonna speed this up. So my overall impression of Adventure Mode Cavendish is that he's a very, very, very good unit. I felt very empowered as a sub with him. I feel very powerful as a captain with him. But what I really felt was missing was his other subs. <laughs> like uh, the other characters on the team with Cavendish are 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 missing just a lot of sh a lot of stuff like um i tried to figure out what i could bring here for this to to bring an optimal team and um i really need a three turn bind and despair remover and i couldn't find one so uh we get to the end here and i'm, I'm really lacking a lot of other subs so my big takeaway is that this adventure mode cavendish is amazing I can't even wait to see what Driven's going to be in the future, man. This guy is so insanely good. So, um, right now, I think Driven is just missing a big a big chunk of what they need to be to be good again. And once they get a, um, get starting getting more and more units that just make them better, then this Adventure Mode Cavendish is really going to start shining even better. But right now, he's really good, just needs more friends. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Only got a few orbs here, just a few. chain lock or anything dude what the fuck that's so crazy that was so fucking crazy what the shit that was 3.8 million well hit with four units oh my gosh that was cool that was cool i enjoyed that <laughs> that was really cool Alright, so we're going to get that 50% HP cut when we go to the room, right? So our HP doesn't really matter too much here. But, I'd like to be able to take a hit. <laughs> A little much. to the Dophi room. I'm gonna go ahead and Caesar special this turn. 
And then we're just gonna wail on this dude here, I guess. Solid. That damage is so high. He only hit me for 5,400? you kidding me? Alright, here we go. This team gets so many orbs, man. It's so crazy. You get so freaking many orbs. It's awesome. I love it. All right, so um, I'm feeling a Fuji special this time. This time around, I'm feeling a Fuji special. Um, I'm also feeling the Judge special. All right, so that's good. All right, so we're gonna do one, two. We're gonna we're gonna tap this dude out and then kill Giola. And this time, we're not gonna miss. Solid, 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 solid. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, so now I I think I can kill this dude. If I can't, then we're gonna take a big hit and we might die. So uh, risk everything on it. Yep. Oh yeah, we're fine. Hundred percent fine. Wow, just wow on that damage, dude. Just wow that damage. <laughs> Just wow. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna hold off on damage. Because we want to kill him this turn, right? And then we'll pop Dofi special, or Diamante special soon. Right, right, right. right. Okay, okay, right. So... I should have, I actually probably should have hit him this turn. I think we're okay, though. Maybe not. Oh, yeah, we should have hit him. We definitely should have hit him. I need a three-turn Binder Spirit remover. Oof. I think I'm dead. I'm pretty sure I'm dead. I'm dead. 100% oh, dead. If you change bottom orbs, that would be so nice if you did. Oh, fuck, dude. I'm so dead, though. There's nothing. I can't do anything here. Unless we can just be a young god here. Yeah, I can't, I can't do anything. So close, so close. Oh my god, dude. We need a we need a three turn by despair remover. That was so annoying. That is so annoying. It did so well until that one moment, and then like, and then the the orb swapping that he did just like totally screws you over. Eat like I just got all bomb orbs, and I'm like, dang, what do I do with bomb orbs? Ah, <sighs> that was really close. All right, guys. Well, that is going to do it for the, um, the showcase for Cavendish. Uh, he is really good, but Driven still sucks. <laughs> Why does Driven suck so bad, man? Oh, it, Driven makes this so hard, man. Driven, Driven versus Driven is really hard, man. It's really hard. All right, guys. Well, I, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, please hit the like and subscribe button down below. And, of course, have a great rest of your day.